Hi again, everyone. So today I'm back to show you what is going to be in my makeup bag this week. And I know I didn't post any videos last week, but my kids had spring break and we went to San Diego for the week. It was beautiful, beautiful, beautiful down there. I, If it wasn't so expensive to live down there, I probably would. It is gorgeous. I love all of the palm trees and all of the pretty plants that they can have. Up here in Washington, it is just too wet and we do not have the heat to have the beautiful like tropical plants that they have there. It was really, really nice. It was very hard to come back here. Although um, we have come back, we got in yesterday, we have come back to good weather. And happy Easter to everybody. Today is Easter Sunday. I hope everybody is having a good Easter. Okay, so let me show you really quick what I will be using this week. So I'm gonna go back to using the Guerlain Lingerie de Peau, I'm not sure if that's how you say it, foundation. And mine is in uh, Beige Claire, I think it is. Um, the only thing is, I'm thinking this may be too light because I have a little bit of a tan. You can't really see it with the lighting. Um, I did get a little bit of sun, obviously, in San Diego. But I still think this will be okay. If worse comes to worse, I'll just mix it with some like bronzer or something. Um, and then I'm going to use with that the Guerlain Meteorites uh, Base Perfecting Primer or whatever, Light Diffusing Perfecting Primer. So I'm going to use those together. And then for, let's see, powder, I'm going to use the IT Cosmetics um, Bye Bye Pores Poreless Finish HD Micro Powder. And this is in Translucent. And... <clears throat> I was just watching a video that Julie posted and I think this might have been the same powder she had and she said it's really really messy which I'm kind of bummed about because well loose powder usually is but I hate messy products so we'll see we'll see how this goes I hope I don't end up hating it because like I said I just bought it okay and then for um, contour I'm gonna go back to the Too Faced contour palette you guys have all seen it, I've shown it before. I'm gonna use that for contour. I haven't been contouring every day, but I have been contouring. And um, I do notice a difference with it when I do do it. So it's been kind of fun to mess around with it and do that. And then I'm also gonna put back in, um, I know you've seen a lot of these products, but I, these are the ones I really, really like. The Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette. I'm going to be using um, that again. I really like that. And then for blush, I am going to use two new blushes I got. I'm going to use the Clinique, and I just got this and showed this in a haul. It's the Precious Posy, so I'll show it to you again. It's a really pretty, um, wow, it's actually, it's just a really pretty peach. It's coming off more pink on the um, viewfinder or whatever, but it's a really pretty peach. And then I just picked up this one by MAC, and it's called uh, Melba. Let me show you that. And it's also a pretty, um, more of a, how would I describe that? Uh, natural, it looks more pink on the video, but it's definitely a more peach, but more of a brownish peach, I'd say. Um, yeah, so maybe with using this, it would lighten or darken up my foundation too a little bit. So I'm gonna use that. And then let's see what else. I'm still working on trying to finish this uh, shadow insurance. I'm almost done with it. I mean, it feels like there's nothing in it, but I can still get stuff out. It's crazy. So I'm going to try to use this up, but my backup is going to be this one by Julep called Blank Canvas, and I have never tried this before, but it's a mattifying eye primer. So that's my backup. And then um, for my eyebrows, I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, Tinted Brow Gel. And this is in chocolate. So that's what that looks like. You guys have probably all seen this. Um, I guess this was brand new. I didn't realize that. I thought I'd used it before. Um, anyways, you know, you brush it on your brows. And this is, like I said, in chocolate. So it's kind of a rich brown color. And then finally, the eyeshadow palette that I'm going to use this week is the one I also recently showed in a haul by It Cosmetics. And it doesn't have a name, I don't think, or I don't see a name on the back, but it's um, 
It's this one right here that I showed you. Really good selection of colors. So I'm going to play around with this one this week. That'll be fun. And I guess that is what is in this week's makeup bag. All right, guys. Again, happy Easter, and thanks so much for watching. I'll just see you in the next video.